Attention. Hey guys, welcome back to One Fat Frog. Today we are here with legendary chef, Chef Bruno. Uh, he is now a part of the One Fat Frog family. So any of you guys who have any questions about pizza concepts, he is going to be the perfect person to go to and bring in and, you know, kind of work out how to, you know, set up either your truck, your trailer, or your brick and mortar. Pizza is one of the most popular foods in the nation, and actually even in the world. And Chef Bruno, you've been, how long have you been doing pizza? Uh, I've been cooking 50 years, really. Yeah, cooking pizza for about 50 years. He has a lot of experience and a lot of knowledge and can easily help you learn how to cook a pizza, how to set up your restaurant, and to show you how easy it could be, he's actually gonna teach me how to make pizza today, which I have never done. You know, it's something I think everyone in America eats at least, you know, once, twice probably a week. And it's an amazing food and today we're going to learn how to make it. So we have a full setup back here with the basic restaurant equipment you need to set up a pizza, restaurant, trailer, anything. There's going to be another video going over all the equipment, so stay tuned for that. But let's get cooking. If I had a choice of food, I would go with pizza. It's good for you. It's not that expensive, and you can feed a whole family for 25 bucks. Yeah. For 25 bucks. Yeah. So what I'm going to do today, I'm going to show this beautiful lady yeah. how easy it is to make a pie. Once you have all your ingredients ready, it's a piece of cake. <laughs> and it also is a lot of fun, right? Yeah, it yeah, is. It, it is a lot of fun. If people look at pizza guy, oh, that's so hard, you know. Wow. Everything takes time, yeah. okay, to get real good. But to start off, it's nothing to it. Yeah. And the longer you do it, the better you will get. You learn all the tricks. You learn all the tricks of the dough, the sauce, the cheese, the ingredients, okay? So we're gonna get started now. Mm -hmm. Let's go into the office, which is my <laughs> kitchen, and we'll get moving. Let's go. All right, now. You start off with a dough ball, okay? Mm -hmm. That's the dough ball. And this is what happens when you stretch it, okay? Now, after you got it like this, you gotta watch me, baby, all right? Okay. Put a little flour. Oh, you need a little flour so it mm -hmm. don't stick, okay? Hold on one second, give me that bottle of water. Yeah, keep taping, keep taping. Keep a little water here all the time, okay? Oh, is that so your fingers don't stick? So, yeah. Perfect. And just go like that, okay? Go ahead. Okay, see what I'm doing here? From here, put your hands okay. over here. Hold down. Mm -hmm. Hold down. Mm -hmm. Now lift, release that. Okay. 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 Well, that's what you got now. Okay, you went. Okay. This you gotta mm -hmm. push it. Okay? okay. Now you gotta make yours on foil, okay? Okay. Now lift it up and put it in your fist. Like I showed you before. Yeah. Go ahead. Start right, twisting. Okay. Start low, right? Keep, so yeah, keep it low so right. The weight mm -hmm. stays down. Stay on the ends. Stay on the ends. Okay, now lift it all the way up. <laughs> Stretch it right. Okay. Okay, you fixed it. See? Not bad, first time. Okay? Okay. All right. Uh, don't criticize, this is the first time. Okay? Now, mm -hmm. you put your sauce on. Okay. In you the said middle. Start in the middle, right? Yeah. Okay. Go ahead. And then press. And spread it out. While you do that, I do this, okay? <laughs> Put 
right here. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right, now, I want you to be like Michelangelo, you know what I mean? <laughs> yeah. Give it a little art. I like pizza to look good. Okay. Yes. Okay, mm -hmm. move a little. Okay. All right. Now you can put your sauce on. I mean, your cheese on. Okay. Well, let me get a little sauce for myself. Okay. And you said the cheese is not like the sauce. You don't you start in the, the middle, cheese. you start at the end. Right. Okay. So, uh, I don't want you to, to feed the chickens, you know what I mean? Yeah. Okay, okay. All right, now, you are ready to go. Yeah. Okay. So, I'll get this metal paddle. And you said get two here, hands, right? Open the door. Put it underneath. Uh, okay. Okay. Up. And lift it? Yes, go up. Go up. Lift it up. Just go up. Okay. Oh. Okay. Ahead. Put it right there in the front. And then. All right. And now we'll move this over. like that. See? Okay. Yeah. All right. Now. Now. Put that back. I'm going to finish this. How fast I do this, you see? Yeah. Do this. I think if we timed it, <laughs> yours would be a third or right. a fourth of the this time of mine. A... All right, this is going to be pepperoni. Hmm. Okay. Go ahead, stop putting pepperoni here. Okay. One. Two. Three, four, five. All right, now, there's a trick. Okay. Sometimes it sticks in the wood. Yeah. Okay. Now, see how I'm holding it? Yeah. Like this. And, oh, okay. All right. That's now, you sit it here on the door, right? Uh -huh. Then you go in. Oh, very nice. You see how easy that was? Yeah. All right, this is well done. Oh, perfect. Just how I like it. Okay. Mm. All right. This is well done. Oh. Nothing beats that smell. I mean, look at this. Ooh. Perfect. Beautiful. That's what people want, really. Yeah. All right. Oh, perfect. This is a tin crust. Mm -hmm. Tin crust New York. Yes. It looks like it came out of a brick oven. But this is a brick oven. Yeah. Really. See all the bricks on top and the bottom? This is a real brick oven. Yeah. Okay. Now let me show you how to cut this pizza here, all right? Go half. Okay. Let me show you the bottom. Oh. Beautiful. Beautiful. Okay. Then. Okay. Five dollars here, right here. One more. All right. You just gotta learn the perfect weight distribution, huh? Well, you're training right now. Don't yeah. think you're professional already. You're not. <laughs> no. So, uh, you have Yours to take that the, one you gotta take the abuser that yeah. I'm gonna give you yet. <laughs> it's coming. Yeah? Yeah. You think you wanna do this for a living? Yeah, I mean, what you've shown me is really easy. I think it's something it that is, it, well, it is do. a lot of fun, really. Yeah, it is fun. I mean, when you think of pizza, pepperoni, there's, there's no limit. Yeah. You could do uh, Alfredo pizza, you could mm -hmm. do Sicilian pizza, you could do Stromboli, you could yeah. do uh, uh, white pizza, you could do pizza with mushroom, uh, with yeah. spinach, with lettuce, pizza with anything. Yeah. And any you, meat, chicken, anything. And you can have it meet any dietary instruction. There's a lot of people gluten-free pizza, keto pizza, cauliflower, vegan, dairy-free, everything. Yeah. So but pizza's very universal. You can adapt it to whatever concept. But don't forget, you still need the, the, the pizza truck. You could have anything you want. You could have this, 
but you still need a pizza truck with the right equipment. Exactly, and that's one thing Chef Bruno is going to help you guys figure out. He's been doing this right. for 50 years right. from small scale to large scale. So whatever you're trying to accomplish, if you have a certain number in mind you're trying to hit per day, you're going to events, festivals, Chef Bruno is gonna help you figure out what size pizza oven you need, which ones are gonna cook to the time you need, and you know, help everything get set up. And we'll always be there for them. Yes, of course. For, for a long, long time. Yeah. You come with the trailer, right? <laughs> well, I will follow up on them. Yes. Of course. Well, after they get my training with the pizza truck, let's say they go to uh, Tampa at the state fair. Yeah. All right. Mm -hmm. I'll be going and visit them. Yeah. Make sure that they're doing everything right. Yeah. Uh, make sure there's no confusion. Exactly. Make sure they're not nervous. Mm -hmm. Okay. If you see a big line, don't get nervous. Yeah. Otherwise, you're going to go down. Yeah. Okay. Do what you're doing. People will still be there. If they mm -hmm. want pizza, they will be there. Yeah. But I'm going to repeat it. If you don't have the pizza truck, you ain't going to make no money. This truck will pay itself in, in a year. Not even, right? Not even. Mm -hmm. I have a, I have a couple of friends. I go to State Fair. Mm -hmm. It's you know five days long. Yeah. Uh, they're not telling me the truth, but I know how much they're doing. But seeing how much flour they they have in their truck. Yeah. They say 60, I'll say by $80,000 in five days in Bloomsburg Fair in Pennsylvania. That's in five days. Yeah. Right, you don't make that in a pizzeria in a whole week. Yeah. And that's one thing, you know, that might seem like a really big number right now, especially doing a five day state fair. Yeah. One of the benefits of Bruno setting up the trailer or the truck for you or even your restaurant is that he, once everything's built, he'll come and show you how to organize the flow because you can talk about it, you'll show them what they need, but then once it's built, yeah. it's gonna, you have him to walk you through everything, walk you through, okay, from prep table to oven to window, how are you gonna expedite that? How is that going to be the best way to make you a profit? Yeah. And Bruno well, can help you with that. Also, I will follow, follow you through the mm -hmm. food, the quality, what to buy and who to buy from. I will put this whole thing together. I will take you to the distributor and say, that's what this guy needs every time he comes. Don't squish the brand. This is what he's going to have. Okay. So when you go to pick up your food, your supply, you get the same thing. Because the worst thing you could do is when you keep changing your name brand. Yeah. Okay. You don't want to do that. Yeah. Because people get, a, uh, uh, people get adjust to your taste. Yeah. And, and consistency will... is important. Correct. Okay. So now we're gonna do something else here. Something new. Learn to dance, learn how to make pizza. 